Hello everybody, I'm Marco Raglianti and I'm a PhD student in the Reveal Group at Software Institute, Università della Svizzera Italiana. Today I'm going to present Discord Dance, a tool for visualizing developer communities on Discord. Here you see Discord Dance in Faro and the user interface of the scraper. You can select a server from the list and scrape its simple or complete model. After starting the scraping, progress bars and the transcript will update you on the status. When the scraping is finished, we can open the server model in Discord Dance. We are presented with a predefined view that we can start to explore. Entities in this view, in this case authors, show tooltips when you hover over them. We have many predefined views packs and we can switch between them and see different entities or a different layout for the same entities. We can select an entity of interest, in this case a code block, and inspect it in the inspector. With it, we can navigate through the objects and reach the message in which the code block is contained. We can also use the inspector's playground to send messages to the object and open the message in a web page. This allows to quickly scroll through the conversation happening before and after the message. Another way to interact with a view is through selection and spawning. We can select a subset of entities, spawn a new window with them and change the view spec to see another aspect of those entities. Selection can be also done programmatically via selection query block. In this case, a piece of Faro code allows to filter entities based on their properties. Discord and support for normalized metrics allows to remove some entities from the view and renormalize the view based only on the entities that are visible. The tool also supports functionalities for handling the underlying graph. We can select the transitive closure of an entity being a node, and we can spawn a new window from that. The views we already presented in the paper visualizing Discord servers and the new ones that we added to the tool can be explored both via the inspector or visually. In the end, the final goal of Discord Dance and the approach we propose is to gain a better knowledge of a Discord server and its content. This concludes our presentation of Discord Dance, visualizing developer communities on Discord. You can find more information on our website discorddance.si.uzi.ch. I'm Marco Raglianti and thanks for your attention.